Well, I started out on the show actually as an extra hmm. back almost 30 years ago. And I, I told that to Linda when I first came on to the show. And I said, uh, she said, you know, we're so glad to have you on the show. And I said, you know, well, I actually used to stand behind you as an extra 30 years ago. <laughs> so she was like, oh, my God. Because I, I lived in Austin. And I used to drive up here and work as do background on Dallas. And, uh, and then... Uh, they gave me a, a small part where I had a scene with uh, with Patrick and Priscilla Presley, and or I didn't. I don't think I had any lines. I was just. I think basically just saw the back of my head, but uh, it was fun. And then I went out to LA and I did I think three or four episodes with uh, with Larry when he was in the in the Nut House, and uh, it was it was so much fun. It was it was uh, it was a great experience just watching because it was early in my career and, and just watching him and learning from him was was tremendous. So, um, actually, with the first one of the first scenes we had, they were they were shooting up, setting up the shot, and uh, they were doing they had done his coverage, and they were turning around on me, and the director was standing there talking to me, and and uh, Larry's just standing there listening, and he the director walks away, and Larry said Larry looks at me and he goes, "Don't worry, it's going to be on me." <laughs> and I have used that line so many times on young actors over the years. I just I, I just I loved it. I thought it was brilliant. It was like, "Yes, sir, it probably will be." Turned out it wasn't on him; it was on me. <laughs> <laughs> so I never told him that. But um, but it you know and then and then when I when I got the audition for it to come in on this, I was like, wow, really? It's it's uh, it's, it's it's where I started, you know. Mm-hmm. So um, fortunately, I came in and had a lot of fun with it, and and uh, Cynthia and Mike liked what I was doing, and and. Um, they like the haircut and they like the beard and <laughs> all that stuff. So it, uh, I, I was so I'm so thankful and so happy to to be able to do this, to be back on the show again after you know this is my fourth it's like my fourth time I, I think. Well, I mean I get to work with I get to work with everybody. And, mm-hmm. You know I get to work with Linda and, and you know and Patrick again and I get to actually say something to Patrick you know and and, uh, and then and then working with. Uh, with, with you know everybody else who's so wonderful and and, and uh, uh, they really are. I mean I know you know people say that all the time about mm. you know casts that they work with, but it really is. It's like everybody gets along so well. The mm. crew is amazing. Um, just uh, our scripts and, and the amount of, of stuff that happens mm. in, in, in our scripts is just like it's yeah you know hell bent for leather. It's just cruising pretty fast. <laughs> so it's 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 uh it's pretty cool working with. Due yeah. to the lights, you know, yeah. for God's sake, that keeps me on my toes, and, and it's such a treat, and such a joy, and such a blessing to be able to work with that woman. She's How do you just, keep a straight face? I see the scenes, and I'm like, oh my gosh, you guys must be cracking up. It's 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 really really hard because like I, we were doing a scene where she was giving me a wet bath when I was in the hospital bed, and my eyes, I was I was unconscious, and I was like, I, she's you know saying all this weird shit to me, and, and, and I was laying there, I was like, I, I was I was killing myself trying to keep my eyes closed because I just wanted to open them up and just watch her, you know, and I get to watch her plenty, and it's, 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 there's some stuff coming up with her that is just absolutely killer, it's just, I mean, it's and, it, and it's and it's such a treat. And she complains about the fact whenever she and I have a scene, she gets the bulk of the dialogue because she's so freaking good, you know. But uh, and she goes, she she'll, she'll look at the scene. She goes, okay, so what? I talk the whole time, and you just kind of stand there, throw a few things in, and and I go, that's the way we like it. <laughs> so, but it's it's um. So I get I get to, to sit and just watch her and and, and uh, watch her work, and, and plus everybody else that I'm that I'm working with is is, is just is. It's 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 a blessing, it really is. Um, I think that he has. Uh, you have to you have to believe that your your character is doing right. You know, no matter how screwed up they are, they they always have to feel like they're that they're. You know, if you if you feel like oh, I'm a bad guy, then you then you look like a you know then you come off as uh, somebody trying to play a bad guy. You know, and, and um, so I think that he I think that he buys in everything that he's doing, and he's doing it out of out of a sense of of uh, of duty. Uh, uh, He's probably fairly conservative, you know. So um, I think that he thinks that he's doing what's right for for his country and and, and for uh, uh, just for what's right, I guess. It's his duty. Does he have any loyalty to his mother at this point? 
That's a really good question. I think that I think that she's pissed him off so much, and they have they have just you know done so many horrible things to each other, um, and she screwed him up so much over his life that I think it's hard. But still, um, I think that he kind of looks at every once in a while and goes, "Wow," you know, and and he, and he sees things in himself, you know, that that in her. Um, there's actually a line in this next script that is, is pretty telling uh, about that. She says something to him, and his response really tells what what their relationship is at this point. Um, I don't think he didn't he didn't intentionally push her down the stairs. I think that was an accident. A lot of people think that he did. <laughs> And, and that there's another there's another line <laughs> that, that references that coming up too. So it's it's pretty it's pretty cool. But I think he, he definitely has changed quite a bit um, with the introduction of of, of Judith um, and their relationship, whatever it is. Um, uh, and and then with them, I think that I think that he's he's you know I think he, at the beginning he started out just as kind of a a kick-ass business, Texas businessman, you know, who just didn't take any crap from anybody and, and did what he wanted to do and, and, you know, ground people under his heels. And then with, with her coming in, it's like now he's almost having to be deferential to his mother because she has the real power. She owns the company and she can, you know, she can boot him out and then he's dealing with a daughter who can have, you know, has, has had him thrown in jail, um, as, as, you know, really messed with him in a lot of ways, but he messed with her too, which was a result of his upbringing and, and transferred to, you know, how he dealt with his daughter, his relationship with his daughter. So I think it really has brought a lot of, it's, I think it's, it's made him, I think it's made him more complex. Um, and with, and, and then with the introduction of the other stuff that's happening this season, it's like, and, and what happens from there, um, it's pretty cool. It's pretty wild. I mean, if you, get, if you know Texas women, they're they're pretty. They got a lot of character. They got a lot of you know a lot of strength about them. I don't know if it comes goes back to the Germanic roots of, of you know the, the number of Germans that moved into into the state, but that's that's very uh, a classic um, characteristic of of Germanic people is the strength, of, especially of the women. You know, and I think I think there's a lot of strong Texas women. I went to school at UT, and I, I you know, I, so I've been around Texas women a long time. And I love them. 